Hi, this is Mike Callahan, Dr. Filefinder, and welcome back to our special Butterstash.com 10-part series on Gmail 401 Graduate Studies. In this segment, we're going to look at remote logout. Being able to have multiple instances of Gmail open is, of course, a benefit. But at the same time, it also can be a liability. For example, you're at a friend's house, you log into your Gmail account, and you leave and forget to log out. Well, now your Gmail is open in a remote location, but not to worry. If you look in Gmail, now that you're home, down here it shows this account is open in one other location at this IP address. Shows the last account activity, and then there's a details. Click that, brings up this screen, shows all recent activity, even keeps track of the time. And then you can just click here, sign out all other sessions. And now the copy of Gmail that's on your friend's computer is logged out. And they would have to put in a password in order to access your account again. You can just close this. So this is how you can take advantage of Gmail's ability to have multiple instances running. And yet you can also be able to log out of all those other instances except the one that you're currently looking at. Keep in mind this is a multiple part series and be sure to watch all 10 parts. Hey, this is Doc. If you're looking for a cheap and easy way to put your own content on the web, go get domain names from Hover.com. Just visit Hover.com slash Butterscotch and you'll get 10% off and support shows like these. Thanks.